Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to make this bar chart for this particular set of data. So what we've got here is boys and girls and their preference for a blazer or sweatshirt with year groups. Okay, I'm using a Mac version of Excel to show you how to do this. So I'm going to actually make this. So I'm going to put this out of the way and then I'm going to see if I can recreate it in this area down here. So the first thing to do is to select the whole of the table and go to Insert and just go to recommended charts and you can automatically see there there is the chart that I want so I'm going to click on that and then I'm going to move it over here and make it a little bit bigger and then it's just about a matter of uh, formatting the chart so let's put the title in first okay bar chart to show blazer versus sweat shirt preference okay and you if you go back to home you can actually change the size of the text if you select on the on, on the bar you can select ch change the size of the text so I went with 20 and bold okay I need to put something in on the axis so if I click right click here on the axis and format the axis okay and what I want here is go to the fill options which is this one here and go to the uh, make sure I'm on the line so, okay make sure you're on the line one so if you look if you it starts like that so you need to be on the line one okay and then I want a solid line and then I'm going to make it three points you can just that's sort of personal preference okay also I'm going to make the text a bit bigger I think I went for 16 okay and then repeat it for the, this axis down here if you've got it already open you, you won't need to do it again so again change that to 3 I'm going to change the color to black so make sure it's 3 like the other one okay and then go Make sure the text is up to 16. That's too much. 16 would be enough, I think. Okay, and this one is up 16. Okay, so both at 16. So what I want, the only thing I need to do now is I can go to close this, and I'm going to click on this, and then make this a bit bigger as well. That stands out. Okay, so the only remaining thing I need to do is to add in these two titles. So I'm going to do adding these two titles. Click on the chart and go to chart design and then add a chart element. And I'm going to add the axis titles for primary horizontal to add in year. Sorry, you have to take out axis title. A little bit of a pain, but there we go. Year group. And then go back to home and make that a bit bigger. And we're going with the 20 in bold. Okay. And then this one. So again, click on the chart, go to chart design, and then add axis total. This one we want the primary uh, vertical, so that's that one. You have to take this out. It's a bit strange writing this way around. Write in frequency. Go back to home, change the size. You have to click on, to click on one of the lines first, sorry. Change that to 20 and then bold. Okay, and there you have your bar chart which will show the data that from this table. So you can now copy that and perhaps copy the table and put it into a PowerPoint or a Word document. Okay, I hope this was uh, useful. Thank you very much for watching.